Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today we are going to be checking out the new Connecticut State Roleplay update in Roblox. So in this update, I think they added the new uh, team that you can join, Sheriff. You could originally join this, but you couldn't really do anything because they were still working on it. So I'm just going to be showing you everything they added in this video. So let's get straight into the video. So I'm just going to drive to the new Sheriff's office so I could uh, show you guys what's new over there. And I'm in a blue Mustang right now, going pretty fast, 123. And over here, they have two new buildings since the last video, of course, on this. And they changed up the state town hall police. And you can go in parking mode. I don't know why that's so cool. So town hall city of Winston, town of Winchester. So if you come over here, uh, there's people that sit right here. Wait. They didn't ever make the, the windows. What are we doing? And if you come over here. Wait a minute. Ooh, the jail cells are in here. I didn't actually know that. But if you guys remember when you could be able to change your character to like a police officer. That stuff is now over here. Like, yo, yo. And all of that and i'm just gonna go to the sheriff's office to show you guys that too okay so now that we are at the sheriff's office as you can see say no we're actually there um which field county sheriff's office and it says that here too and when you walk in the building straight away there's a little desk area where you can say why you're here and what you're doing here and if you go up into this door and then go up the stairs, there's a jail cell to put all the bad people in. Hopefully not me. I haven't done nothing bad for us. And this is where you change your outfit. I'll show how to do that too. And an uncovered room. And this is where, where you can put your car and here's the parking lot. And to make it easier to save like so much time, or not time, but just to do something, I'm going to become a sheriff to show you some of the cars and just all of that. So when you spawn in straight away, there's a new thing where you can put in your call sign. I'm just going to put in a six, seven, two. I was going to do three, but. And if you see at the top leftish, there's all the people that are officers and the incoming calls that is from the game when there's a fire nearby and they want you to come help. And this is the locker for the new um, sheriff skin. With the vest, it looks much better in my opinion. And you can have loadout one. And that gives you a police bat in V3 or version three, whatever you want to call it. And here are some of the new cars. I'm just gonna delete. Oh, so recently like yesterday they just added this new sheriff car i love the design on all of them with the black and yellow and white and orange design i really like it because you can be like acting like a swap member or what you guys might like there is an explorer so then and you can hear there's like the uh, bots talking in the background just to make it feel like real this is one of the explorers and you're like why doesn't it have that uh like the normal sheriff one it's because i'm about to spot it in right now takes a while to load too but that's okay please don't say i did the wrong one and yep here is the regular one very nice and if you go inside you have this steering wheel moving of course with lights this is for all of them by the way the sirens i'll mute why the sirens go off so those are the sirens for all the sheriff cars 
just in case you needed or wanted to know. And there is some sheriff trucks, but I believe that they are um, just blue. If I'm mistaken, that'd be amazing. Or let's see. Yep, they're in the white, blue, and black. And as you know, same ones. Oh. So these have different sirens because I don't think they're in the black color version from the original. And we got a Tahu. Tahu Poo. Okay, that's just cringe. And this is like a longer version of the Explorer. And I'm just gonna drive a uh, charger around to just show you the speed and stuff. So, yeah. So this is the first person to the car. You can have a spotlight on. Sorry if the, my voice is kind of like lower. My volume is like all the way down, but you know. Ooh, the lights just turned on. Ooh, look at that, that's kind of cool. And it's a very nice stealth car if you're trying to catch any criminals from doing anything bad. And if you remember from one of the videos, I was stretching stuff out with the thing when you're a firefighter. They removed that because that was a glitch and the K-12 used to be able to kill people, but because the damage done with it and they took that out too and the police button was um you could have damage with it but now you just sit them down so you tell them to stop and i really like that too because they're making it more realistic well the k-12 i get it you could but with the separator that does not make sense at all oh my goodness i just got that gas speed and turn on these sirens but I know who I am. And a lot of people do tend to stay with the role play and actually pull over and go in the bank. Or, not the bank. The, what's it called? What is it called? A jail. Just to make it fun for everybody. I really don't know where that guy went. Look how many civilians there are. Wait a minute. Wait, how did this guy put my car in park mode? Yo, bro. And this is the Hawk. And that is really cool as well. Sir, please get off that motorcycle. Sir. Sir. Drop him in. Let's get him on the ground. Yo. Wait, what? What are you trying to do, sir? And I'm just happy that everybody who plays this game is always having a good time because it's just fun. So, no, my siren. It's annoying. Uh. So, I think that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. I'm showing you guys the new update in Connecticut State Roleplay. I definitely recommend this game to you if you like playing like a real, life game roblox even though in real life but it's just a really fun game if you want to be a police officer firefighter and i'll just show all the teams as well look at all those teams so i hope you guys enjoyed the new update and the review on it and goodbye